Another big story tonight, Indianapolis increasing spending in its 2023 budget without raising taxes. There will even be a property tax relief for about 90 percent of homeowners funded by the American Rescue Plan. Danielle Zakoski explains the city's latest plan. The Indianapolis City County Council passed the 2023 budget in a 21 to 1 vote. Three councilors were absent for the vote. The budget focused on four main subjects, public safety, infrastructure, education, and property tax relief. Another bipartisan budget passage. Obviously, our main focuses in the budget this year were public safety and infrastructure. We added to the $150 million uh, investment we made with American Rescue Plan funds, added a new higher salary for our starting IMPD officers, also doubled the size of our signing bonuses uh, for new IMPD recruits. Uh, in addition to that, on the infrastructure side, the largest infrastructure investment in our five-year capital plan. It allocates $5 million for the Crime Guns Task Force and provides $10,000 sign-on bonuses to help IMPD recruitment. There's also $2 million for the city's first team of mental health professionals to help those in crisis. There's other departments in other parts of the country that are trying these things as well. Uh, and I think that is another one that's a move in the right direction. People with more specialized training, uh, I think, will we'll benefit those citizens we have that are in crisis. The budget includes nearly $288 million for roads, bridges, and greenways in the city, and nearly $157 million for stormwater system improvements. This is part of a $1.1 billion investment over five years. We put a traffic engineer for the first time specifically working on safe streets to make sure that we're always putting our thoughts around how do we make our seats, our new streets as we rebuild them to be as safe as possible. There is also $500,000 earmarked for the Indy Achieves program to help people finish up their higher education. Great time for that as the job market has obviously been hot and there are a lot of people wanting to get into the market but also move up in terms of how much they make. This budget also includes a $150 property tax credit for homeowners whose homes are valued at $250,000 or less and a $100 credit for those whose homes are valued up to $400,000. In Indianapolis, Danielle Zolkowski, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.